Do you hear that? The little background noise? That's the pot of stock. It's talking. It's talking to us. And another garnish. Grab a container. We'll do the same for the green onions next. Might as well just chop them all right now while we have it out. Next up from here, we're gonna be prepping our potatoes for mashed potatoes. Get them all cut up and into the pot for boiling. And then from there, we can do the chicken dredge and basically get the fryer going, I guess. We crush this prep. It's 3 p.m. now. And then my delivery guy today, Ken, said the earlier the better. Yeah, my favorite group, Cups and Roses. <laughs> And this, the parsley is just going to get sprinkled over the veggies after they're roasted. So do the citrus, herb butter, or sorry, citrus butter drizzle, and then do the sprinkle of parsley so it all sticks. Nom. Just two this week, Mike. Just two. One to someone from our work. Who is going to come pick up? Chrissy Dubs. And then one to our other bro, Ken, who has ordered the most from us. He messaged me late night on Thursday and was like, I know it's too late like for the cutoff for ordering, but I just found out I'm going to be home this weekend. And I was like, luckily, I always have extra portions. Like I always have around two extra portions just in case that does happen. There's the parsley. Oh, the parsley hand, the dreaded herb covered hand. And then we'll just give this a quick wipe. Same with the knife before we do the green onion. Look at how much chlorophyll I just put on the wooden board. Wild. What's everyone else uh, eating? Eating, cooking, ordering tonight? What's going down? What kind of deliciousness are we spreading here? Do you three of these sliced up? Yas, mish, bolognese. Eric's gonna probably order some Chinese food tonight. Love it. What's your go-to order, Eric? We're going Brussels sprouts, Annie. Lovely. Just a simple roast up. I don't take you as the Brussels boiler. That sounds like a villain name in a movie, the Brussels boiler. This movie is really coming together here. This is okay, this bottom bit. I'm just gonna trim off this side part. Ooh, sous vide Brussels sprouts. I never even heard of that. You'll have to try it out. Would be good for infusing flavor first. And then just like a quick broil up to get some crispage going. Usually go low main. Yum. That's always good. And like not that expensive either, right? Okay, so I always cut the onions in half there. Kind of like where they split in half from the greens to the whites. And now we'll just do nice thin slices. And this is the garnish for the mashed potatoes. <laughs> 